Да! Damn it, they're too strong. Fall back and reorganize! <laughs> Morons. Wolfgang, you've done a splendid job driving off that squad in such a short time. I don't need flattery. We need to stay focused on the capital. Soon Starkburg will fall to Wayne, and the way will be open. Our two-pronged assault cannot fail. Yes, of course, sir. Great work, Wayne. With your help, we easily turn back the enemy. What happened to the rest of their squad? They retreated toward the capital. We also received the missive that said Wolfgang will be leading the attack from the direction of Klain. Right. The two-pronged attack. We must begin at once to keep the element of surprise. Exactly. We need to head east as quickly as possible. Simon, you finish up here. Yes, sir. Good luck, and be careful. Wolfgang! Ah, Wayne. I have a task for you. On the hill just ahead, there is a keep I want you to seize control of. I know the one you're talking about. Taking it would be a decisive victory. I know it as well. It's heavily fortified. I know it will be difficult to take. That's why I asked the best in my army to do it. However, you must go at once. We've received word that reinforcements are heading this way. The keep must fall before they arrive, or it will be next to impossible to take. Consider it done. There is the entrance to the keep. We're in luck. They don't seem to have much troop support. If we can take this, I bet we can win the war! You may be right. Let's take the keep while Wolfgang creates his diversion. To victory! General! Enemy sighted! How can they expect to take this place with so few soldiers? Don't underestimate their strength. That mistake led to our previous loss. If we can hold out until Julia's reinforcements arrive, their defeat is all but assured. We have no choice but to fight well, then. <sighs> I'll fight too, Kenshin. But Ernest, you're... you're wounded. Wounded or not, I will not see Bernstein fall while I still live.
Surrender, and I promise no harm will come to you. You know we would die before surrender. There will be no negotiation. When our reinforcements arrive, we will have you drawn and quartered slowly. You've made your choice then. You are to die, as will your reinforcements. Thank you. 
If you told me I'd be beaten twice by scrawny traitors, I'd have laughed in your face. If I took you one on one, it'd be a different story. We did it! Excellent work, Wayne. Wolfgang! Now that we have all of the key positions under our control, I'll negotiate a truce. Truce? But with a little more effort, we can crush them! We have them surrounded. There is no need for more fighting, unless they demand it. All I want is independence, not more bloodshed. I have no interest in occupying Bernstein. I see. We should seek a meeting at once. Wayne, I would like you to accompany me. Of course. Your Highness, Wolfgang has requested a meeting. So, he sent a messenger to mock us? No, Highness. He came in person. What kind of fool comes to the enemy camp in person? He hasn't won this war yet! Fine. Show him in, and we'll see what he has to say. At once, Highness. Though we know each other's actions well, this is our first meeting in person. It is a pleasure to meet you. What business do you have here? Are you to mock us? I'll cut right to the chase. As leader of the mercenary kingdom, I petition a ceasefire. A ceasefire? All we ever wanted was a home for our people. We have no need of expanding our borders further. Further warring would be meaningless for both sides. If you will acknowledge our kingdom, bordered by the Lost Forest and Schwarz Falls, I will agree to a ceasefire. Your Majesty. I understand your proposal, and see now that you have come bearing goodwill. I agree to a ceasefire, then. Draft official documents at once. With this, you have proven yourself to be a wise and fair leader. And in your first official treaty, you have proven yourself the same. This new beginning bodes well for both our kingdoms. Thanks to your help, we've witnessed the birth of a new nation. It was a difficult fight, but the success in the end was worth it. Now the difficult task of building a stable kingdom lies ahead. Yes, without the proper foundation, all that we have fought for will quickly fade. I'll work hard to make sure that doesn't happen. Thank you, Wayne. You've proven yourself an honorable man. The snake calling the vulture honorable. <laughs> what a laugh. Byron? You didn't think I would let you slink away unpunished after how you humiliated me, did you? Oh, brother. Is he serious? If Byron gets lucky, Wolfgang could die.
This is my opportunity. I must take it. The time for both of you has passed. I will lead the new nation. They say revenge is a dish best served cold. I agree. Brother, I... I understand. You killed our father, and I swore to kill the man responsible for that. I had no choice. Wayne, promise me one thing. Promise to build the kingdom that we fought for. I won't promise it will be the same as you imagined, but I will protect those that look to you. The mercenaries and their families will be cared for. I suppose that's all I can hope for. Farewell, brother. Goodbye, you bastard. Byron gets lucky, Wolfgang could die. I can't let Wolfgang die.
Absurd waste of time. Come on, let's get out of here. <laughs> 